Hey guys, it's Sunday morning. It's 10.20. I just ended the Adobe stream at 10 and now I'm going to edit the vlog. And I'm still so salty about Jane the Virgin. Like, you have no idea. Like, I almost started crying last night. Okay? Okay? I even had to show Christian, like, the, the episode. Because I've been kind of keeping him up to date on some of the happenings and stuff. And so... I'm just like, Christian, I always used to talk to someone about it. So I'm like, Christian, I'm going to talk to you in the Virgin too, even though you don't watch the show. I'm just going to talk about it. <sighs> anyway, the tiredness is finally hitting me now. Now that the live stream ended, it was just like this wave of, oof, like my eyelids feel so heavy now. And I'm like, ah. <laughs> I'm still going to try to stay up though. Um, I don't even know how well I'd be able to sleep even if I tried because I did have a large coffee. Didn't win anything, by the way. <laughs> and so... That's a lot of caffeine for me, so I don't know. <laughs> it's like I'm tired, but would I really be able to fall asleep? Probably not. Here's what I did during the stream so far. Oh, I'm struggling with it. Like, this is much more shading than I usually do with watercolors. Usually I do pretty flat color, but I'm like, oh, I'm gonna step it up and try to make it all awesome. But it's, I like, I'm just not used to watercolor, so I'm learning and like I'm adding too much water and then I have too much pigment so I'm trying to water things down but then there's too much water again and it's just like oh it's a struggle and then this is supposed to look like this on the edge that's the look I want but this all needs more work this is kind of just like first pass at this skin and have to let some stuff dry before I continue on with it and it's dry now I can keep going but I'm gonna save it for another day because I have to do book stuff so I'll just work on this again during my stream on Tuesday Doggo looks funny with just the outlines. Oh, look at this. Look how cute this baby is. Oh, so cute. Christian, I adopted a dog. What? I adopted a dog. Last night. Babies. <laughs> She's like getting up. He's like, what? <laughs> Just a symbolic adoption, you know, like adopt an endangered animal, you know? Okay. <laughs> it's now 11.03, just finished editing the vlog and my eyes are dying and oh, oh, <laughs> it's hitting me. I'm like, maybe I should take a nap. I don't see myself being able to sleep for more than like three hours. Like I won't do a full night's sleep, but... I kind of wanted to keep going a little bit longer. Like, I thought maybe keep working till 5 and then nap or something, but... I might have to take my nap soon. Come on, second wind. I'm surprised it took me this long to get to this point. Like, usually maybe around 5 or 6 a.m. is when I start to feel like this. But, yeah. <laughs> so I'm now working on the picture that I started the other day where I was worried about the ink bleeding. And surprisingly, there's no feathering of the ink at all. Like, my tests that I did were worse than this. And this just turned out great. And so I'm like, yes, it worked out. Because this is a computer printout, not the original ink. So it's not waterproof ink. And so I've been really concerned about it. Especially when the tests didn't go very well. But um, it worked out. While that paint is drying i'm going to start sketching out my next scene i'm just doing some research it's kind of like a little garden scene so i'm just looking up ideas for different plants and things i can include like i've already did some of this research when i planned out the piece but i just kind of want to go in and get more concrete ideas instead of just like oh i could use that I could use that i'm gonna go no i'm gonna use something like that and i'm gonna use that and that's gonna go here and that kind of thing oh i see a little area where the ink did run Oh dear. Nothing too major. It's only one spot, but you know. Here we go, Kiki. Here's the big piece. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, it's stuck on you. Hi, Christian. <laughs> I threw a bunch of photos together in Photoshop just to plan out the composition of my next picture because it's very detailed. It's a garden scene and there's a lot of stuff in it. And so 
I wanted to kind of paste things together just to know what's going where. And so did that, printed that out so I can look at it. And yep, I'm gonna take a little break though. I think I'm gonna go shower and then come back to this. So update, I slept. <laughs> I went upstairs, like I said, I was gonna go shower, but I wanted to eat first, so I ate. And then I went in the bedroom and I was just gonna check a few things on my phone and I was kind of laying sideways on my bed and I started drifting off and I was like, let's just nap. If I'm tired, let's, like, let's just sleep. But it was very interrupted. My body didn't really want to sleep. So it was like three hours of sleep, but very on and off. So probably totaled a little over two hours, but it still felt nice. I still feel really tired, especially in the eyes. Like, I don't know, it helped, but <laughs> I'm still tired. So yeah. And then I finally showered and it's about what? It's, oh, it's exactly six o'clock now. So, yeah, I guess I will just continue on with my art stuff. I honestly don't know if I can function at this level or if I need to like go back to sleep or something. I don't know. And ignore my weird face. I'm not wearing makeup today because it's like so late in the day. I'm like, I'm not even gonna bother putting it on. It's just one of those things where I know I need to still get so much done because I definitely underestimated the amount of time it would take me to do these art pieces especially the one I did yesterday it's a really detailed scene and so well for me it's really detailed and so it took a long time and uh this one that I did the mock-up for today is also very detailed and again contains a lot of vegetation and stuff although well no I shouldn't say it's gonna be a little easier it's probably gonna be just as time consuming to do and you know how yesterday I said I was feeling all serene and stress-free, just like la 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 coloring. Well, today I'm back to the hmm stage, so yeah. And the only cure for hmm is to start working, so yeah, let's get back to it. I think I am going to go try to sleep a little bit. My mind's telling me no because I got a lot to do. But my body, my body is <laughs> telling me to go to sleep. Mm. See, now that it's actually dark, I might actually be able to fall asleep. And I know I can use one of those eye mask cover things during the day, but my brain just knows. It's like, no, I know it's daytime. I'm not falling for this. I mean, they do help a little bit, but I don't like the feeling of it on my face. Okay, time for a little nap. Couldn't sleep. I still feel like death, but not sleep so with our Shaw cable that we have we can access a lot of the shows on mobile devices but this is not every channel and I realized today that a channel that is not on here is AMC so The Walking Dead is back tonight but this only has a small selection of channels compared to what we have on our actual cable box so man I mean, I have it set to record the show, but that means I can't watch it tonight because I need to work on stuff. <laughs> By the way, I feel much more energized now. Tammy's on her more way energy. With her son. Feeling good. So I finished another picture, and now I'm going to color one that I drew in ink the other day. Um, I'm kind of torn because I had scanned it and fixed a few things and reprinted it out, but on the printout, the lines look so thick. And I don't like that. So I might actually just color the original and hope it all goes well. Another reason I wanted to print it out is because the blue ink can sometimes smear it and I outlined it all in blue. Um, hmm. But I think I'm going to try. I'm going to try inking or try coloring on the original. I'll start with some light colors and see if it's smeary and that might help. And there are the things that I photoshopped, I'll just have to photoshop after. It's just kind of annoying because if I'm saving off like nine or ten steps for this thing, I'm going to have to fix that in each step. <laughs> but I feel like it'll be more worth it to have the nice line art and then have a bit more fixing when I'm editing the picture. I think that is the more ideal situation. I think it'll look better in the long run. But before I start coloring, I'm going to go into Photoshop, take my line art and just do some really crude coloring just to plan out 
what colors I'm gonna use. I kind of have a basic idea already, but I just wanna lay them down to make sure I'm not putting two similar colors beside each other. Like I don't want the background to be similar to the hair color, that sort of thing. So plan out some colors in Photoshop before I move forward. I'm so close to being done the next picture, but I'm crashing. It's 4.30. I'm gonna go to bed, finish it tomorrow. So thanks for watching. See you guys tomorrow. No, that thing in the middle is a dead bug inside the light. That's not the buggy you were chasing. Okay, you know what? I think that's enough. Okay, we're done. I humor her antics, but only for so long.